The left is also telling us that this was not a rogue group of FBI agents that staged this raid. The left says a judge had to sign the warrant. So what point is the left trying to make when they say this? That there must be something legitimate in the warrant because there's no such thing as a corrupted judge? Who is the judge that signed off on this warrant? This guy's name is Judge Bruce Reinhardt. Have you ever heard of him? No, neither had I until I researched him. Who is Judge Bruce Reinhardt? Well, he signed the Mar-a-Lago raid warrant and he was a prosecutor on the 2007 Jeffrey Epstein case in Florida. That's the case where Jeffrey Epstein made a plea deal where he got off basically scot-free after the government made a very pitiful, pathetic effort to hold him accountable for the sexual abuse of young girls. Bruce Reinhardt was a prosecutor on that case, but in the middle of that case, he quit. Why did he quit? He quit to form his own law firm. He went from being a prosecutor to a defense attorney. And who were his first clients? He became a defense attorney for friends and employees of Jeffrey Epstein. These friends of Jeffrey Epstein ultimately got immunity. They were not held accountable by the law. What the heck? Bruce Reinhardt, who signed the Mar-a-Lago raid warrant, when he started his law firm, after he quit being a prosecutor and became a defense attorney, his law firm shared an address with Epstein's lead lawyer. But a judge signed the warrant, guys, on the raid on Mar-a-Lago. Oh, I'm sorry, not the raid, the visit that was paid to Donald Trump. Because every nice person, when they're paying someone a visit, comes with sirens blaring and lights flashing when the occupant of the, of the residence isn't home. But a judge signed this warrant. Show us the warrant. Show us every detail of this warrant. I wanna see, not just the warrant, I wanna see the attachments, what exactly, specifically, the scope of what was authorized to be searched. These warrants don't give authorization, typically, for a willy-nilly search of someone's property and premises and every detail of their life and their family and their business and their office. They're typically limited in scope. I wanna see that scope. I wanna see the affidavit or affidavits that supported the warrant. That means I wanna see who swore that there was probable cause that the FBI would find something that the FBI wanted to find. I wanna know who was behind that. And I wanna see this warrant without any redactions. Not a single sentence, not a single word, certainly not a single name blacked out, nothing.